Yo, what's up guys? I'm Ezra Cosson. Welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, for today's topic, we are going to discuss Is the product that FIPO sent to me worth buying in 2021? But before we start, roll intro. So guys, someone sent me a package from Hong Kong and yeah, you guessed it right, this is a sponsored video so if you're interested in purchasing the product, links will be listed below so please do check it out. But anyways guys, I'm very excited so let's do an unboxing or unwrapping. So let's go. So yeah, initially guys, what I think about the packaging is that it is really well packed. As you can tell guys, it's really formal and it's really safe and this... What's this? Oh, so we have some kind of paperwork, guys. Uh, what's this all about? Hmm. Oh, so I'm not sure, guys, if I'm allowed to show you this one, but it's from a company called, or the shipper or exporter is from Shenzhen Fipo Technology Co. Ltd. So I believe it's from China, and the brand is called Fipo or Fipo Technology. So, yeah. Anyways, guys, let's move on. So, guys, quick update. I managed to remove the second layer, or the first layer, I'm not sure second or third layer but anyway and we're now left with the last layer of this package guys oh my gosh i think there's two packaging guys or there's two package rather i think they sent me two gadgets guys two watches i'm not sure oh my gosh fipo and i think this is a ladies watch guys or for girls and at the back guys, we have the QR code. I think this is the QR code that will direct us to the app of this smartwatch. So we will unbox this later guys. And next we have this one. Fipo. And the brand is called Bingo Fit and it's color white. So yeah, I mean the box is really straightforward guys. So there's nothing much to explain about this one. No complicated information, details, specs or whatsoever. So let's go. Let's do the unboxing. It looks like a G-Cash, a G-Cash. <laughs> it looks like a G-Shock guys, look. Oh, it's so nice. So yeah, let's take this off guys and check the accessories. And below that is the manual. So I believe this is the first page of the manual guys, there. Yo, I'm so hyped guys, to be honest. Yo, it looks so cool. So this is the watch guys there so i'll be putting this aside first and check the package or the accessories so first we have the charger which is similar i think to this charger's watch or to the charger of this watch guys and yeah that's the only package you guys or accessory that's inside this box so this is the watch guys so as you can see guys or my initial impression or insights about this one is it looks like a g-shock watch guys so there so let's take off this one So guys, I'm really excited. So let's turn this on. So this is the watch, guys. There. I'm not sure about the specs, guys. I haven't done research yet. But I believe this is not an AMOLED display, guys. But yeah, anyway. So guys, that's the first watch. And now let's check the second watch. Again, this is just an initial review, guys. But later on this video, I'll be explaining my insights. So anyways. So here's the second watch, guys. It's the FIPO or FIPO. I don't think this is a smartwatch guys, but it says here it's a smartwatch. So yeah, let's do an unboxing guys because I'm really excited. So, let's go. What's this for though? <gasps> oh my gosh guys, look! I think this is not for me guys. It looks really premium guys. As you can tell, it's stainless steel there. So similar to earlier guys, we're going to be checking first the package or the accessories. So we have the magnetic charger as well guys, there, and the manual, which is way longer than the first one guys. So let us now turn on the watch guys. Yo, it doesn't want to turn on guys. 
What's happening? It doesn't want to turn on. I think it's broken or something. Or maybe it doesn't have charge, guys. Maybe I'll charge this first, guys, and I'll get back. So, guys, it's been officially a week and I think, I don't know, five days? But anyways, it's been officially a week and end day since we unboxed the products that were sent to me by FIPO Company and Aliexpress. So thank you very much for sending this out to me. It meant a lot and I enjoyed using those watches. So if you're interested guys, links will be listed down below so please do check it out. However guys, before we start the review, I have one good news and one bad news. So the good news is, this watch, the FIPO, the green box one, the watch for men is working. However, the watch for ladies, which is this one, it doesn't work. But anyways guys, looking on the bright side, we're still blessed because one of the watches that was sent to me is still working. So, yeah. So similar to our previous review guys from the Mafam MX-5, we're also going to be doing a point of view perspective or POV perspective. So I'll show you what I mean guys in 3, 2, 1. Let us now turn on this watch. So guys, we are greeted by this watch face and for us to change the watch face, what we need to do is to long press the watch face. So we have this one, next is this one, next is this one, oh this looks nice, next is this one. And lastly, we have this one, which kind of looks like a techno or a futuristic watch. So guys, that's only our default watch faces and take note, we can't add or buy more watch faces. But anyway, sliding from the left, we have the notification center. So whatever notification is in our phone, it will be shown here. Next one is from the right side. We have the pedometer. So it measures our beats per minute, our steps our number of steps, the kilocalories burned, and the distance we partook. Next we have is the blood pressure or the measurement of bloods per minute. So here's my reading guys, 84 beats per minute. Next is the sleep monitor. So as you can tell guys, I only slept for 5 hours and 50 minutes which is wrong guys. I slept at around 12 a.m. earlier and I woke up at 7 a.m. or 7.30 something, I don't know. But anyway, and lastly guys, we have music control or music control, music control. But anyway, so we can play or pause, we can move to a new song or go back to our previous track or previous song. Next function is sliding from the top. So first feature we have is the do not disturb option, which is this one. Next we have is brightness control or brightness level. Next we have is find my phone. So in case your phone is missing guys, you can just simply tap this one and the phone will vibrate or I mean the phone will make a sound. Next we have is stopwatch. Next we have is settings which we'll discuss later. And lastly, we have is this one. So basically guys, we can't do anything, not unless if we press this power button. And last function to maneuver is to slide from below. So first we have is settings. First we have is brightness, which we have discussed earlier. Next we have is, I think this is language. So we have nine of them. Next we have is reboot. Next we have is Restore. Next we have is the QR code. And lastly we have Product Information. So as you can see guys, the bracelet version or the brand or model of this watch is called SW218. So next we have Steps, which we have discussed earlier. Next one is this one, message, or our notifications. Next we have is sleep monitor. Next we have is this one. We have HR, BP or blood pressure, SPO2 and breathing. So let's start this one guys. So here is our reading guys. Next, we have SPO2. So here's my reading guys, 98%. 
And lastly, we have breathing exercise. So you just need to simply follow this one, guys. Next we have is sport. So we have walk, run, cycling, basketball, football, and badminton, and ropes keeping. So I must say guys, I am surprised because the company added some great visuals just to simply illustrate the sport itself. But anyways guys, they are similar like for instance, it tracks our steps, kilocalories, and the beats per minute. Next we have is weather or weather 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 so as you can see guys there's no data yet cause it's not yet connected to my phone which is this one the iphone 7 so yeah let's connect it first so guys i managed to connect my smartwatch to my phone so it's called sw218 and it's not raining guys it's super duper hot but anyways so these are some of the weather for the next days Next, we have is music control, which we discussed earlier. Next, stopwatch, similar to first one. Next, we have is flashlight. Next, we have is find my phone, which we discussed earlier. And lastly, we have settings. So yeah guys, that's pretty much the features of this watch and I must say it's nice, it's decent for its price. And by the way guys, in case you're interested, links will be listed down below so please do check it out. So guys, if you have these watches or you have used one, kindly comment below your experiences with it. Let us communicate and socialize and have a community and share knowledge to people planning to buy smart watches and lastly guys if you want a shout out just comment below anything with the hashtag and the shout outs so guys that's pretty much the end of the video thank you very much for watching see you in the next video Peace.